even with people with disabilities, they have a right to live wherever they want and where they want. I think everybody has a right to live where they want to live. Why well, I was living with my parents a lot a while back, and and it's good to be independent and make those decisions on my own. I mean, I always wanted my own place. He was like, Stephen, you're incapable of being out. And then my mom would be like, hey, you know, you can do what you want. But then she would always worry too. I, I actually had went to my parents and told them, you know, I want to try living on my own. And they said, go for it. For the first time, getting on your own, it's a little scary. It's, it is, it, you know, living on your own, it's not a piece of cake, all times. What I like about living by myself is privacy and with my own thoughts and I get to do whatever I want without being controlled. Yeah, I'm more independent. I do baking and exercising and all that. We go out in the community sometimes. I volunteer with my church three days a week, and I also volunteer with the SPCA. Hang out with my cat. Her name's Penny. I've had her a few years now, and she usually hides when people come in. <laughs> I get ILS coming. My, my instructor comes Monday to teach me cooking and to help me do, you know, go out in the community and do what I need to do, like if I need to go to the bank. They come and they help us to like get up. They make sure we have our breakfast. She cooks and I come home. I can tell because she cleans. I can smell the clean, I can smell the food. <laughs> my parents and my respite worker are my support. We go shopping, we go to dances, we go to bingo. I have an Elton Regional Center worker. He's one of the support team. Somebody that comes in every day like that spends the night and then another worker that comes in for part of the day. Well, they help me like clean my house or take me grocery shopping. So we have our support that we need, but then we have time alone. I get along with my neighbors. Yeah, I, I get along with them, I interact with them. Um, the ones across the way, if I see them, I say hi. That neighbor is really nice. She looks out for me. Like the neighbors upstairs, they're not part of Alta, but they they look after me. We we watch each other's back. It's not always easy, but you know, if you have support and workers like I do and people that I can trust to help me out with things I need, it, it helps. To have the supports necessary for them to live on their own. I am so thankful for services because if I didn't have any services out there at all. You know, I don't know if I can make it total, totally by myself with no help at all. So I'm thankful for all the services that I have. I would say advocate more for yourself if you can. If you feel like you can do it, then do it. Be positive and think that, yes, you can do it. Home means family and Home friends. is a place to spend with my family. Spending time with my family and with loved ones. Means spending time with family, having my pets.